Hey you, welcome to this video. In this video I'm going to give you tips and tricks how to become a Minecraft Hypixel Master, kind of. Some tips, tricks, so you're more likely to win and get better at the game, so it's more enjoyable. So let's get started. So let's start with the basics. As you all know, when you press shift and click on an item in the chest, it will go immediately immediately to your inventory. This is really important because you can save time and with this time you can rush people and get the element of surprise. Second really important basic thing is bridging. Bridging can be done by shifting and pressing S to go backwards. This is just really basic. The third important thing in my opinion is or basic thing is organizing your inventory. You really need to organize your inventory so you can fight easily. Let's start with the tips. One really important tip is to rush your opponent or neighbor when you're low on armor or have bad gear. Try to get the element of surprise so you can get around 3 hits before they hit you, so you're certain of winning the fight. This can really change your game. As I'm trying to rush someone because I'm low on armor, but he's kind of disturbing me. So, a very important tip is to see when your opponent isn't looking so you have an opportunity to build. So let's see, as you can see I just failed. A tip by watching them is by pressing F5 so you can see where your opponent is standing while he can see you. So let's fast forward a bit till I make it to his side. Okay, here we are. Now I'm fighting him and I already saw in the corner of my eye that someone is coming. Always be prepared for cleanups because they are always there. And you think I'm ready? But another one is coming, be prepared, it's really important and you don't want to get stuck getting clean up because clean up is really annoying. A third tip is to throw eggs or snowballs at your opponent to knock them back. It doesn't really sound helpful but it really is, because it will give you time to jump to his island so you can get to safety, so he won't knock you off. So now let's start about talking about rushing the middle. Tip 1 is to know which map you are playing. If the islands of the map are close together, it's not advisable go to go to the middle because people can easily egg you off or snowball or shoot you off and you don't want that. So the second tip is to first eliminate all your uh, opponents who are close to you. When you have done that, you can go safely to the middle. You can also go safely to the middle if the islands are far apart, but you still must watch out for your opponents slash neighbors. Let's go to another tip, or more a trick. A trick is to, when you jump down, you can place a block or a water bucket to take less damage. Because you take less damage, you have more health to fight your opponents. This really helps. Souls. Souls are really important for the game. With souls, you can get new kits and new upgrades. Souls are really important. You get, can get more souls by clicking on shop, then on soul upgrades. Then click on the gold ingot. If you fully upgrade it, you get 3 souls every win. You can also hire a dead gold or some other guy to get souls for you. This is, this is advisable in the early stage, but later in the game when you're more experienced, this won't really help out. Since I already have 50 souls, I get like 200 souls a day. You can upgrade this, but it won't really help because you always open your souls. So now let's go to the soul opener. You can open souls by clicking on this. If you click in the middle, not lots of people know this, you can open more souls at the, at the same time. If all 5 slots are full, you open 50 souls at one time. Now you open only 10 souls, so 1 spin. I always have it on 5. So let's open some souls. This is sadly the end of the video. I hope you all enjoyed. I hope I could help you out with some tips and tricks. You could help me out by sharing this video and liking it. You also would hugely help me out if you could subscribe. I'm trying to reach 100 subs at the end of August. So, see you all in the next video. One, two, three.